What's up guys, in this video I'm going to show you what the offensive playbooks of the NFC North teams will look like in Madden 19. Three of the eight divisions have already been covered, so be sure to keep an eye out for the video your team gets featured in to get an inside look at what you'll be working with in the upcoming Madden season. So starting off the division will be the Chicago Bears, who I've talked about in a previous video as their offensive playbook has seen a massive overhaul in Madden 19. With Matt Nagy coming in, they have a completely new offensive look that closely resembles the Kansas City Chiefs playbook. I will say the one disappointing thing is that they did not give them the gun bunch quads formation, which would have gone a long way in making the book much more unique, as the Chiefs are now the only book in the game with that formation. Bunch quads aside though, uh, they do have a solid playbook. I would say nothing truly stands out too much about it, but on the other hand, it isn't just completely devoid of any good formation, so it could see some play early on. Next up, we have the Detroit Lions. From what I know, the only change to their playbook has been the addition of the iForm Pro formation, making them the least changed playbook out of all playbooks that at least added or removed a formation by gaining one. Uh, Detroit's playbook has really kind of been mediocre in my opinion over the last several years. It just doesn't have any of the big power formations in it, such as you know stuff like Bunch Weak, Deuce Close, Trips Tight End, Gun Bunch Tight End, stuff like that. Um, this year's really no different, and obviously you never know how the meta will shake out, and so it could be good, but I don't see this being one of the more popular playbooks in Mad 19. Third, we have the mighty Green Bay Packers, led by Mike McCarthy. Based off of what I have, it appears that the Packers playbook has gone unchanged in Madden 18 to Madden 19. This isn't a bad thing, as they have had one of the better playbooks in the game over the past couple of years. In Madden 17, they arguably had the best gun bunch week in the entire game, and in Madden 18, Problem in particular showcased the ground attack it possessed out of formations like single back wing, deuce close, and ace slot. Now, with gun bunch week nerfed and the run game a question mark early in the season, it'll be interesting to see if the Packers playbook remains a top selection or if it ends up slightly falling off in Madden 19. Lastly, we have the losers of the NFC Championship game, the Minnesota Vikings. Just like Detroit's playbook, this one has seen the addition of one singular formation, although that one singular formation is arguably one of the best formations in the game, and single back deuce close. Like I said in my previous video, just because a playbook was not changed or has had minimal changes does not mean that they didn't make any changes before releasing the final build of the game. Minnesota has some solid formations throughout and is the only playbook in the game with the near jumbo formation, which would honestly be an absolute joy to see someone run an actual viable scheme out of it. Overall, I'd say this will be an average playbook this year and is definitely good enough to be used. Well, that is going to do it for this video, guys. As always, thank you for watching and be sure to subscribe for a ton of Madden 19 content for the upcoming season. Until next time, guys, take it easy.